time you got here. W what's the rush, Doc? I, it's a Saturday. This is a Saturday that I'm waiting all my life for. Welcome to my latest experiment. Is, is that an infinity? Bear with me, Marty. Give me two men and funding, and I can change the world. Give me ten men and funding, and I can end it. But all I've got is myself and a generous amount of plutonium. And what does that give me? A time machine. Are you suggesting that this car can travel through time? No, I was implying that they invented a nuclear toilet briefcase. Oh, okay, but, but how does it work? In a nutshell, it runs off a flux capacitor, which generates tons of electricity and goes really fast. Once this baby reaches 88 miles an hour, you're going to see some serious shizzing. So if something bad were to happen, like let's say right now, how would I operate it? It's very simple. All you have to do is type in the date you want to go to into the keypad and reach 88 miles per hour. And then shabam! Time travel. I've already put 1975 into the console. How am I supposed to find plutonium in the middle of the jungle? Coconut shrimp, pepper shrimp, shrimp salad, shrimp fried rice, shrimp pizza, shrimp burger, shrimp sandwich, chicken and shrimp. Catfish and shrimp, tilapia and shrimp. That, 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 that's about it. How can I think of Have you ever been on a shrimp boat before? No, but I've been on a real big boat. <laughs> Hello. What? Where are we? Why? We're in Vietnam. V Vietnam? Oh God, why, why would Doc set the time machine to the Vietnam War of all places? Probably to find a guy named Charlie. We was always going on long walks looking for him. Well, I think Charlie might have some of this plutonium that I need. I either need that, or I'm gonna need a lot of lightning, and it does not look like it will storm anytime soon. Well, I think I remember Lieutenant Dan said something about plutonium at a nuclear research institute somewhere near here. Well, I think I could get that. I think I could use that. I could go and grab some for you. No, you don't understand. You'd have to be powered by a flux capacitor in order to run there without getting shot. Well, I don't know what one of those is. Now, you wouldn't believe me but I could run like the wind blows. All right, well, if you want to try, go for it. But, you know, it just sounds really stupid to me. Stupid is as stupid does. Hey there, I'm Bubba. Have you ever been on a shrimp boat before? <laughs> Forrest! Forrest! I got the plutonium! Forrest! Forrest, they shot Baba! Hey, Bubba. Hey, Forrest. Forrest. Why did this happen? You got. Shot. I wanna go home. We gotta go. We, we gotta go now. Come on. Come on. I'm oh, ah. sorry, Bubba.
Bubba was my best good friend. That's Doc! He's about to get shot! Look out, Doc! Run, Forrest! Run! Great Scott! Open the door! And that's all I have to say.